We're going to go ahead and prove the following trig identity. So what we're going to do here is I'm going to start off with the left, 1 minus cosine theta over 1 plus cosine theta. And what's going to happen next here is I'm going to take the conjugate of the denominator. So I'm going to get 1 minus cosine theta over 1 minus cosine theta. And we're going to get 1 minus cosine squared theta over 1 minus cosine theta quantity squared. Now on the bottom here, I'm going to go ahead and convert this uh, trig identity to sine squared theta. And on top, we'll have our 1 minus cosine theta squared. And what we can do now is we can go ahead and break this up. So what's going to happen here is I'm going to go to the left here. So I can do quantity 1 over sine theta minus cosine theta over sine theta quantity squared. And if you see here, this right here is equal to the cosecant, and this right here is equal to the cotangent. So we end up with quantity cosecant theta minus cotangent theta, all of that squared. And this is exactly what we were looking for. That's how you do it.